that's a lovely catch. He strikes immediately. Mendes. No oh, massive one over off seam to get the spinner on. Imamul Haq, he's on 49. He tries to play the square cut, but the ball comes on with the arm. He gets cramped. The ball did not turn. And hence, no width. And the wicket Sri Lanka needed. Imamul Haq, who's batted so well, goes for 49. It's 97 for two. Up, up, yeah! and gone. There's the pressure. There it is, and it's taking its toll here on day five. And all you need to do is toss it up, get it on a length. But the batsman is not comfortable defending. He tries to get on the back foot. He gets in a mess. He tries to go down the ground. And it's always a risk. He might hit you for a four. He might hit you for a six. But... That's your best way of getting a wicket. That's the seventh one that falls. Ramesh Mendes picks up his second for the innings. Mohamed Nawaz it is. He's gone for 12. Pakistan at 205 for seven. Ah! Oh, Andre Stumps. Wicket number nine. Pakistan is low out of batsmen. They are in a rush, aren't they? Just going after every delivery. All that. Once again, looking at the slog sweep. Flap of the pad. And then the ball went on to uh, disturb the stumps. Wales dislodged, wicket number three for Mendes. Quick fire 11, and it's 243 for nine, Pakistan. In the air. In the air. Fielder getting underneath it. And that's it. Sri Lanka has won the test match, leveled the series, and they have regained number three position in ICC test ranking. Sri Lanka have a good record here, but so do Pakistan. Pakistan play well in Sri Lanka. It was always going to be a closely contested series. And it's that man in picture who has certainly been a difference. Robert Jai Surya brought into the side for the second test match against Australia. And he has not looked back. He has been absolutely brilliant with ball in hand and has played a big role in ensuring that Sri Lanka have leveled this series. And it's befitting for Angelo Matthews as well, playing his 100th test match and his team on the winning side.